All right, in this tutorial, I want to show you how to embed an Excel object into MathCAD. This is going to be for the purpose of passing data into Excel and then displaying it in a table and then plotting it on a 2D chart that will be on the Excel worksheet. And then I'm going to pass one piece of data back from Excel back into MathCAD. All right, so begin, we want to create some dummy data. So call I'm going to make an array uh, dummy data. I'm going to insert this. I use uh, my matrix tool. I can click uh, here or I can also type uh, control M which ins brings up the dialog. And I'm going to put in some numbers here, just dummy placeholders. Okay. Then I need to make another list. Control M. I'm going to give some names here. Bananas. Uh, pears, uh, what, pineapple, pineapples, uh, peaches, and um, mango. Okay, now I'm ready to insert my object, my Excel object. So I click here on the little puzzle piece. A number of different things you can insert, like MATLAB. There are other objects like Visio and so forth that you can link in. Uh, but here I'm going to insert Excel and I'm going to do it from an empty worksheet. And I want to display it not as an icon. I actually want to display an Excel object, uh, a part of a spreadsheet in my MathCAD worksheet. So here's where I uh, define what I'm passing into Excel from MathCAD and what is going to be returned to MathCAD. I want to pass two uh, sets of data. One is going to begin in cell A1 and the other one in B1. So I'm going to pass the data1 array and the name1 array. And then I'm going to have one output. I'm going to, I'm going to set this, uh, let's see, A8, uh, let's say. All right, and now I'm finished. I think it's opening Excel at the moment, so it takes a, a moment. Oh, come on. <laughs> Okay, here we are. So I want to pass, before I do this, I actually need, I need to, um, where's my control in? I need to actually take the transpose of this because I entered it as, I entered it as a column array, but it actually needs to be a row array. So I'm going to take the transpose. Okay. Now I'm going to pass name one and data one. I'm going to okay n fruit as my return object. And there the data is passed and is is displayed. Now let's double click on this and we actually enter Excel now. And I'm going to make a little graph. So I'm going to go to insert. Uh, I want a bar graph. And bingo, I get a bar graph. Oh, what happened? Okay, let me resize this. I don't want the legend. Let me go to layout. Uh, legend, no legend. Okay. And here we go. Now I wanted to, I said column or cell A8 was going to be um, my output. So let me just sum my fruit here, an example, and close out of here. Bingo, I get 30 uh, passed back to N fruit. And there you have it. That is how you can pass data into Excel from MathCAD, process it, display it, and so forth, and return it back to MathCAD. Uh, one final thing on formatting, notice I can, uh, when I double click on it, I can actually bring this up here and limit the view. Let me, there we go, makes it look a little cleaner. And there you go.